Live on the final day for the NFL Combine in Indianapolis, where pro hopefuls uh, certainly vie for the attention of the NFL. It's also some new attention to a one-of-a-kind high-tech training tool that football players at IU have been using. Randall Newsom got a chance to go to Bloomington to check it out and bring back the results to us. Good morning. Good morning, man. You know me by now. I just couldn't resist. I had to try it for myself. Not only could I see the technology, I had to go ahead and get in there. Got it! Power. For the Indiana Hoosier football performance staff, it's the difference between winning and losing. We live by power. Power is a big deal to us. So they're using any and every resource to get an edge in the offseason. They believe the key is simply science. So when new stuff comes out, uh, you try to get ahead of the curve and jump on as fast as you possibly can. The 1080 Sprint, a new technology using data to help them train. But if you don't have the numbers, you're guessing, and we don't want to guess. And it's not just about finding their strengths. Every athlete, every football player has weaknesses, flaws, issues that are holding back from high performance. They're also taking advantage of their new EMG system, targeting the muscles. Players log into their own profiles, and the computer does the coaching. Our athletes don't have to think. They're telling the weight to do, how fast to move it. They have no room to give anything less than their best because there's a 3D camera watching their every move. We want to develop guys. We want to use our system to maximize every ounce of potential our guys have. All to give their guys the best possible outcome and prevent injuries. For Dr. Matt Rea, the new toys, along with his wealth of experience, has him feeling confident that he can have any player ready to perform at a high level. Bring me the fast guys, I'll make them even faster. Of course, I couldn't just trust his word. I had the itch to try it for myself. Uh, I'm going to test out this so-called top-notch equipment, and I got Doc with me. Doc, I feel like I'm just as good as any athlete you got here. I mean, I, I, I feel like I'm pretty athletic. I'm gonna test yeah, it out. You might, you might be. We'll see, though. <laughs> the thing about data, you can't hide from data. <laughs> One thing I found out, my time on the field has definitely passed. I've got the soreness to prove it. Meanwhile, the Hoosiers are hoping their best-kept secret will help lift them over the competition, helping their boys win on the field, and for some of them, it could mean a better shot at the NFL. You know, you, you send them up there for the most important job or interview of their life. And they could see this investment paying off big very soon. All right, you can learn more about this new tech on our website, wishtv.com. And Scott, I got to tell you, I'm still hurting. I'm All still. Right. But that's good, right? Oh, no, it's not good. No? It don't feel good. <laughs> it's in the knees. It's everywhere, man. Ouch. It, it, just, it still hurts. That's more you should, you. These are probably not the best shoes. Either. That's all right. That's more about you than the workout, though, right? Uh, ah, the workout seems good, but, you know, the shoes were wrong. <laughs> I, the got shoes were wrong. <laughs> I got you. I got you.